press the bell icon on the YouTube app and never miss another update. Are you looking for a creative business idea that is pleasing and profitable too? Did you ever think of starting a basket business? It is really an innovative idea for you. In fact, it makes you satisfied and nurtures your creative mind and sense of designing. It would be a real opportunity to show off your talents by presenting gifts in unique form and grab a decent buck simply being at home. Running a basket business is a common endeavor, but still acquiring a great popularity in the world of small home-based businesses. To start profitable basket weaving business, one requires thoughtful planning and a high level of creative mind, having flair for design. Using a wide range of raw material, an entrepreneur can initiate customized basket weaving business from home location with moderate capital investment. Bamboo is durable and is a sustainable material, as some species can grow more than a yard in one day. Bamboo baskets can be decorative or conserve as a place to store magazines, craft supplies or other items at home. The basket will take many hours, but you can always work on it in your free time. Cut a 3-foot piece of bamboo vertically into 4 planks using a large knife. Cut each plank in half. Divide the halves into layers, starting from the back side of the bamboo. Snip the ends of the bamboo strips with scissors, if needed, so they are all equal lengths. Peel the bamboo strips to separate, and create more strips of bamboo. Unroll, and cut a 5-foot piece of string. Thread the tapestry needle with the string. Gather 3 pieces of bamboo, and wrap the loose end of the string around, the end of the bundle. Wrap 3 to 4 inches of string around the bamboo. Curve the bamboo into a U-shape, and wrap the string around both sides of the U6 times to secure. You will have a small loop. Bend the loose end pieces of bamboo around to where, they lay alongside the loop. Stitch around the bamboo pieces, and through the loophole with the tapestry needle. Use a whip stitch while keeping, the stitches close, and next to one another. Make about 10 to 20 stitches or until, you have made a complete circle around the loop. Pick up another 3-piece bundle of bamboo. Add it to your basket by placing, it underneath the loose bamboo, that is protruding from the ring. Wrap the string around, the combined bamboo bundle 6 times. Wrap the string around the bamboo, and the coil of the previous row by inserting, the tapestry needle through the coil, over the bamboo bundle, and back through the coil. Continue to add bamboo, this way until you have reached your desired size of basket. Create sidewalls by sitting, the upcoming row or bundle on top of the previous coil as opposed, to the coils being adjacent. Build the rows on top of each other to build height. Wrap string around, the top coil of the basket to finish, the basket off. Measure out 6 inches of string from the end, of the basket, and cut. Tie a double knot in the string as close to the basket as you can get. Snip off the end of the string, and use the needle to tuck the knot into the bamboo coil. Marketing is the most essential task you should continue to sell your baskets. Sure, customer service is the best ever marketing tool in this business. You need to take advantage of it by attending customers personally, and providing them your best services. Satisfied customers will return back to you with further needs. If you have any question, you can comment below on this video. Finally a request, please don't forget to subscribe this channel, and stay with us.